Hi everyone, it's Jay here as always with reviews of mobile games from Mob.org. Let's go! Today we have something a little unusual when it comes to game genres from mobile devices. It's a logic quest. Yes, there will be no action or anything like that. There will be only the reading of dialogues and the studying of clues. And it's actually pretty cool. So let's meet Detective Grimoire. Well, as you've probably guessed by now, Grimoire is the name of the main character, who is a detective and who investigates murders. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. This game had a predecessor that might have been a good game if only it had a decent budget. It was much worse in graphics, music, and animation, but nevertheless it had a good story, a strong enough one evidently to justify this continuation of it. The story. Since it is the main and almost only part of the game in a quest genre, it's the real star here. Our story begins with murder. Not only that, this murder took place in a bog. The local legends say that there is some monster that has been lurking in this area for 60 years, and even the local cops think that this monster must be the murderer. Hmm, could there be more to this story? Well, that's left for the player to find out. Graphically, the game is in a drawn animation style. Reminds me of a comic book, or should I say graphic novel? But despite the simplicity of it, it's pretty damn stylish, I have to say. Everything is in its place. And this, combined with the music and mystery, immerses you in the atmosphere very well. The gameplay, in principle, is standard for point-and-click style quests. Move to locations and interact with objects through taps. Talk to people and gather the facts and evidence. There are mini-games here and there to diversify the process. But there is also one more thing which I really enjoyed, which was the thinking process of our detective. Sometimes the protagonist says that he should think about something, and we get sucked into his head, where we collect then some judgments on the available facts manually. So we take one fact, then check out the next fact, and then look for a phrase which would connect them, and a phrase which would fit at the end of the sentence. And Eureka! The detective has thought up something. Hey, that's pretty cool. I like thinking for this dude. Generally, it is a good game. I recommend it to all fans of atmospheric quests with good characters and captivating plots. That's all for today. Follow, like, and stick around. This was Jay with reviews from Mob.org. See you!